Oh, Manchester. <laughs> yeah, we're far from home. Three hours away. Why were you in Manchester? For Gashaborn! <laughs> <laughs> so I saw, so in the Clafford Centre they have a Namco Funscape. I'd never heard of it before, but apparently it's no. quite, they've got a few branches across the UK. Um, and it's essentially amusements. So we're not here for amusements though. I saw from the 25th of March they had a permanent Gashapon station. So what, what is Gashapon <laughs> for the people that don't know? Capsule toys. So you know when you go, oh, I don't know, when you, even when you go out for the day, it's really popular in Japan as well where you get the naff little toys in the twisting machines. And Gashapon, the term has been around for about 60 years, I think. Yeah. Uh, and in Japan, I think they changed it into they moved it more into the, the plastic capsules that you know as time has gone by and I've always said if we ever go to Japan like that's what I'm going to spend a lot of money on because they're just so fun and so silly. Yeah <laughs> so they're, they're not your like typical sort of 20p machine yeah. things you see in like supermarkets so they they class themselves as like a, a high quality uh, sort yeah. of collectible so that's why they fetch a bit more of a price where you've got to pay for them yeah. um, but I think what we're the main, like Ellie's saying, the main reason we're here is just just to experience it where we can before we go to see it in real life. Really. Yeah, and they're done by Bandai, so you like to think they're not going to be like totally naff. Um, yeah. I saw pictures of it. They have like these weird bug ones. So I said to Richard, he's only allowed the beetle. No, <laughs> I don't want beetles. But before we go in, Gashapon as well. So it's spelled with either an S H or C H. When you Google it, people do it different ways. So I don't think it matters too much. But it comes from the sound the noise makes. So like the the gash, gash art is like the, the sound and then the pond is when the ball drops into like the thing like so there's your gash upon facts yeah little, little uh, tips <laughs> yeah let's go get some toys let's get some toys <laughs> We're going to give you the grand tour of the four things we purchased. So we got Flame Kirby. I like Flame Kirby. Yeah, I think Flame Kirby is my favourite. Although I need to open the Animal Crossing one as well. And I'm just, I can't turn the camera around. So I'm going to show you, I got a cinema roll, a little clip. Richard, would you demonstrate the clip for me, please? <laughs> you have to wear it. I did see that one. Oh. There we go, very handsome. And then what did you get? Have you opened yours yet? It's this no. little one. No, what one is it? This one. Just got balls rolling around. <laughs> Nearly. I'm trying to figure out what it is. 
I think it's it's literally just like a fake console. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> oh, I thought it would have done something. I thought it did as well. Oh, that's a bit anticlimactic. Yeah. What is it? It looks like a little, it's like a fake Tamagotchi. It gives me like, it doesn't, what? What a dupe. So this is just to keep it as like a little ball, so you don't need that. So that was, it came like that in two bits. So you take that off. And then when you get home, you're going to fill it with water. And it's a little animal causing snow globe. Okay, that's adorable. I think that one's one of the better ones. I do, but you know what the problem is? Now I want the set, but now you know, you, because it's because of the nature of it, you don't know what you're going to get. So I could get four the same. Exactly. Uh, you're just going to have to drive me to the one in Norwich now. <laughs> <laughs> Nervous laugh. Uh -huh. 